guys, Miss Cross here today. First of all, I want to welcome you to fourth grade. We are so excited to have you um, to be our new students this year, and we cannot wait to get going with all of our learning. So I want to take a couple of minutes today to talk to you about something that I have a little problem with. Actually, kind of a big problem. I am obsessed with fourth grade science. Just ask Miss McGrath. She tries to calm me down sometimes about science, but it doesn't work. I get so excited about science. So um, you're going to see a lot of me when it comes to science lessons. So I want to kind of talk you through how science is going to look while we are learning digitally at home. So you will be watching a lot of slideshows for science and you will hear my voice sometimes when you can't see me. So I wanted you to all see me first um, because sometimes the screen will be me talking you through some different slides that are going to be all kinds of science topics we're going to learn this year. Now, your teacher might pause those videos and do some live teaching with you um, as those slides go along. But we are going to do a lot of wondering, a lot of noticing. We're going to plan investigations. We're going to develop models. We're going to see things in new ways that you might not have ever seen them before. And you're going to love it, okay? It is going to be so much fun. We're going to learn about the water cycle and outer space. We're going to learn about force and motion. We're going to learn about food chains and food webs and light and sound and just so many things. I get excited just thinking about it. So today you're going to have your first science lesson and this week we're just going to be kind of getting you interested in fourth grade science because your brains might have gotten a little sleepy over summer. I know mine did. So we got to get ourselves awake and ready to learn science. Next week we're going to start our first science unit and we want to take the next three days to really get you prepared for what science is going to look like. So as you watch um, the videos of slideshows, be sure you have a science journal composition book. You can go ahead and label it with science on the front. Um, sometimes if you don't have enough journals, you can share your social studies and your science in one journal and maybe start at the front with science and the back with social studies if you need to do that. Um, but you will need to take notes and you will need to write things down. So be sure you have your journal handy and let's go. All right, you're going to watch your first um, science slideshow today, and I cannot wait. I will see you again really soon for more science. Have a great day, guys. Bye.